Hey, it's Eric Plantenberg. I wanna to talk to you today about something that is what I'd call my secret agent of getting stuff done. And it, this is so counterintuitive to people. In fact, most people when they hear this, it just doesn't make any sense to them at all. But I promise this is one of the things that has propelled me and most of my top clients forward in many areas of their life. And that's to be not only dedicated to, but completely passionate, you can even call it obsessed, with taking time off. If you think about it, your job, your career, your involvement in civic organizations, local nonprofits, charities, the things that you're putting out there in the world, now that's really important. And I love that you're passionate about that and I love that you care about that. And then you've got to give yourself time. You have to give yourself space to not only regenerate, but to continually fuel yourself with the things that are most important to you. So that is gonna look it's gonna look differently for different people. So the how long it is, the size, the shape, the where you go, the what do you do, that's not the important part. The important part is that you're finding something that you're really excited about that fills you. And the objection that you're gonna have, the objection that most people have, is that, well, I don't have the time or I don't have the money, and that's BS. That's all I can say about that. You make the time, you'll find out the money. I mean, some of our favorite vacations are staycations where we don't even go anywhere. We just unplug the phone, unplug the computer, and then stay at home, and I love those. So you have the ability, and it might be a weekend, it might be longer than that, heck, it could be a couple of months. You have the ability in your life to customize it to figure out a way for you to put something in front of you that really fills you. It fills your heart, it fills your head. And in doing that, you'll have to get more creative. I mean, listen, you're a smart, capable, responsible person. There's no, there's no question that you're not gonna let a business not get done. You're not gonna just let all of, the, all of things come crashing down. When you make a commitment to doing something big, and you make a commitment to doing something fun, you make a commitment to doing something you're passionate about, what will happen is you will stretch, you'll grow, and you'll figure out ways to either get more done on the front end or to develop strategic partnerships or to, you'll figure it out. I guarantee you that I get more done working 10 months a year than I would if I worked all 12. If I worked all 12 months every single year, man, I just wouldn't have the pop that I do. So this is very counterintuitive to people that the more you stretch yourself, the more you're actually able to get done. I had a couple friends come over this week, neighbors of ours that are considering starting a new business, and there's a lot of legitimate hesitation about money, about time, about keeping your job and all that stuff, and my advice to them, as it would be to you, is just go for it. Because the more that you stack on, and especially when it's stuff that you care about, when it's stuff, it's stuff that you're passionate about, you grow. This is how you get stronger. And yeah, there's gonna be bumps and bruises along the way. And yeah, some things will go wrong. Good, that's part of the fun. Live a fired up year. Because the only way that you're gonna live a fired up passionate life that you're gonna look back on and go, wow, yeah, I really, it was, it was awesome, is to be stringing a bunch of those years together. So don't, what you do, the when you do it, the how long you do it, that's not the important part. The important part is for you to find something that excites you, that you can be looking forward to, and that forces you to step out of the treadmill, the hamster wheel of your normal year. Get some things that you're really excited about, post them, I'd love to hear about them, and that'll inspire other people. So I'm off to Mexico for a month. I hope you guys have a fabulous month. Happy Mondays will be coming along, so don't, don't worry about that. I'll be shooting them from the beach in Mexico, and I look forward to seeing y'all really soon.